the lift relation and injectivity subcategories. We begin with a couple of definitions. One, let M be a morphism in a category A and I an A object. Then M lifts to I, provided for each amorphism F from A to I, there exists a not necessarily unique morphism G from B to I, such that GM is equal to F. And two, let M be a collection of amorphisms. An A object I is M injective, provided for each morphism M in M, M lifts to I. We denote the full subcategory of M injective objects by the following and call it the M injectivity subcategory of A. We have the following results. Let M be a collection of amorphisms. Then the M injectivity subcategory of A is closed under products and split subobjects. We first show it is closed under products. Clearly, the terminal object, which is the empty product, is M injective by the universal mapping property it enjoys. Next, consider an arbitrary non-empty product of M injective objects IJ. Then for each M morphism M and each A morphism F from A to the product, there exists a morphism G sub J from B to IJ such that GJ M is equal to pi J F where pi j is the projection map of the product. Thus, by the universal mapping property of the product, there exists a morphism g from b to the product such that pi j g m is equal to pi j f for each j in j. And thus, g m is equal to f, giving us the product as an m injective object. Second, we show the injectivity subcategory is closed under split subobjects. So let I prime be a split subobject of I and N be a split monomorphism with retraction R, where I is M injective. Then for each M morphism M and A morphism F from A to I prime, since I is M injective, there exists a morphism G from B to I such that NF is equal to GM. Thus F is equal to RNF since RN is equal to the identity and that is equal to RGM. Therefore, RG is a lift, showing I prime is M injective. Note that we may assume M contains all split monomorphisms and is closed under composition since one, every A object X is split mono injective, and two, suppose M lifts to X and M prime lifts to X with M and M prime composable, then we see that M prime M lifts to X as well. Therefore, we may assume that M is a subcategory of A containing split monomorphisms. By dualizing everything above, we obtain the notion of a projectivity subcategory, and we leave it to you to dualize the above results.